Hi, everyone. I'm Steve here with Nicole. Thanks for being here, Nicole. Absolutely. Thank you for having me. Nicole is a certified nutritionist, and we're going to tell you at the end if you want to find out more information about how to get a hold of her and find out what her services are. Um, but today we're going to talk about something. We're talking about this off camera that just drives us both crazy. And, um, you know, grocery shopping, going to the store. I'm a people watcher. You know, I'm, I'm always looking at people and analyzing, maybe judging in a wrong way. But I'm always looking at people's shopping carts. And it's like I see people I know in the grocery <laughs> store. I, I bet you get this, too. They always say, don't look in my cart. Every single know, why thing not learn from me in a grocery store because they know I'm a nutritionist and they don't want me to see their cart. People that are my friends. I'm like, holy cow. <laughs> I know. I get it too. Don't look in my grocery cart. I'm like, yeah, yeah. Well, then you're going to make me look in your grocery cart. <laughs> right. So I was, we were talking about this and I was in the grocery store. You were saying you were talking to your husband about this and I'm, I'm going in the grocery store. I'm going in the grocery store to get some organic fruit. You know, this time of year you can get, you know, fruit and I'll eat it sometimes in the summer, you know, blueberries and strawberries and it's all organic. And, you know, and you get the little, little container that's seven bucks. Yep. Absolutely. Well, people can't afford to eat like that, mm -hmm. but I know I'm going to get you started here, but <laughs> You, you can't just go grab an apple, uh, the cheap apple, or you can't just go grab the, the 12 eggs that are three bucks. You can't eat those. No. You, you, no and and yeah, I walk out with a little bit of fruit that for today, you know, my wife had a little, I had a little, and it's 40 bucks. Yep. People can't afford that, but you can't just go grab uh, you know, especially right now, they can't afford this stuff. And but you can't go grab the the carton of eggs that's the lowest price or even the the middle price. You have to get pasture raised organic, right? And that's eight bucks. Yep. You know, you and I, we both have our own chickens, so that's where we get our eggs. But you can't just go grab. See, I'm making myself go off. <laughs> <laughs> you can't just go grab an apple off the shelf at the grocery store, can you? No, you can't. The other day, just like I was telling you, the other day we walked out of there with four bags and it was somewhere between 120 and 150. And it, those bags had hardly nothing in them. One of the things that made me so angry was I was looking for organic blueberries and I went right next to each other. The little piece was organic, the little bucket thing was organic blueberries. I had to search for them and they were this big, the big long one. So mine of organic was upwards almost seven to $10. The big one, $4.99, but they weren't organic and I'm sure they were sprayed with all sorts of glyph glyphosate. So I'm like, that's, re that's why people are getting sicker and sicker and sicker. First of all, you can't afford it. Second of all, you know, people aren't looking for those kind of things and they're not making good use of it once they do get the $10 little tiny tray of blackberries. It's sitting in the fridge and now it's bad. You've just wasted 10, 10 bucks. Yeah. And, you know, we talk about this a lot, you know, everything's packaged yeah. and, um, it, it's it's crazy, you know, the, the protein bar or whatever. There's, you know, you just look at it, you know, the natural flavors and all the seed oils. And really, one, I heard a statistic, one out of five teenagers have fatty liver? Yep. Why is that? It, it's not because they started drinking at age seven. <laughs> yeah, let's start drinking alcohol. I'm four years old. By the right. now, by the time I'm sixteen, I'll have fatty liver if I drink enough. That's yep. not what's happening. But is that how bad the food is? Yep. Well, I this was so interesting to me the other day. I did a TikTok 
And I just got reamed by a couple people about seed oils and about how they're good for you and I should stop preaching my pseudoscience. Okay, you people who think that it's pseudoscience, go back when seed oils were introduced and now come to nowadays and see how much sicker we are. We are sicker with fatty livers, teens with fatty livers. Uh, I see diabetes. so many people with diabetes, autoimmune conditions. It's I'm in business because of this, sadly. It should be that we all want to be healthy. It really makes me upset when people poo-poo and don't do their own research on things like seed oils. We've turned healthy things like a few protein bars that would have been okay back in the day now just have a ton of crap and seed oils and sugar and you and they're this big instead of this big anymore it makes me insane yeah and you know if you guys follow the channel you hear me say all the time i ate so much junk as a kid me too you know but it wasn't the same no. the sugar wasn't the same nothing was the same Nope. You know, we drank out of the hose. You can't drink out of the hose now. <laughs> I just did a te water test on someone's home and she's not drinking out of there anymore. <laughs> it's crazy. And we used to do all those things. Do you remember putting your mouth underneath the sink and drinking it like that? <laughs> yeah. yeah. You can't do that now. Nope. And I don't know. It's just... It, it, the, the whole thing about, you know, the fatty livers and that fast and the back to the seed oils, just go do some research on how they make that stuff. Yep. You're going to go, is this something that we eat or put in our car? Right. Exactly. It's if something needs a perfume because it smells so bad being broken down, there's a problem that that is not pseudoscience. That is fact. Yeah, and just go watch, you know, videos of how they're making this stuff and it's yeah. it's just crazy. And and just because we can and this is the last thing I'll say. <laughs> just because we can eat something does not mean it's food. No. Oh, I love that. Absolutely not. Does not just because it's made for convenience and you can grab and go does not mean it's food. Yep. And, you know, I can swallow rocks. Yeah. Rocks are not food. There's yeah. lots of stuff I can eat that is not food. Yes. And um, anyway, there's our little quick rant. <laughs> um, Nicole, so how do people get a hold of you? And I, I know that you'll give $100 off if anyone mentions this video yes. on your program, your full blown program. Yes. Tell us a little bit about what you do and uh, how they can get a hold of you. You can reach me at the gut girl one at gmail.com. And I'm on all social media platforms as the gut girl NV. Um, and you can, uh, I get a hold of labs before we meet so that I can see match symptoms with what I'm seeing in your labs. I do weight loss resistance. I handle autoimmune conditions. I teach you how to eat properly, even when it's difficult. Um, all specifically to you and what you have going on. All right. Thanks, Nicole. We'll talk to you next time. Thank you.